Hey guys, just uh, want to do a quick video uh, showing my, uh, my flash arrestor. Give it a couple hits, and I got a torch to show you. Uh, right now, we've got the cell running at uh, about 8.6, 8.7 liters per minute. Uh, and that's by volume, HHO. bubbler and here's the cell I'm running on a uh, this is two 59 plate stacks and they're running on 120 volt right now let's see so 121 volts DC and 15 and a half amps the uh, this is the uh, rectifier box, and you can see it plugged into the wall right there. Okay, so we got eight, eight, almost nine liters a minute. Here's the res reservoirs. Let's take a look. Hopefully you'll be able to see the flash. Turned off the light, so I just have the ambient lighting now. Let's uh, let's let's give it a hit. Okay. Okay. Here we go. There you go. Yeah, one other thing I want to show you this this torch I've got. Let me set it up here. an old plate of mine but here's the here's the torch it's got a uh, right here it's marked for oxygen so you could feed in oxygen here um, down here we've got the HHO valve and we got my HHO hooked up there and this would be the valve for the oxygen if we had some oxygen to put on it. I like to try hooking this side up to a compressor, uh, just using some compressed air to see if I could cut steel easier. But uh, let me show you. Let me show you this. somewhere. Let me turn off that other light. Yeah, 
There we go. Now you can see the flame. That's crazy long flame. Okay. Let's see what it does here on... Uh, got some aluminum. Cut that. Well, let's try the uh, stainless here. Let's see how it does on that. Didn't have too much problem cutting that. It'll just take that stainless steel. Go. Made pretty easy work out of that stainless. So the tip on there is marked uh, 350. Oh, there you go. This is Steve at Greenfield H2O. Thanks for watching.